you lay off <laughs> my do right now, or I'll flatten you. The slickest pompadour in town. You really do have a nice pompadour right there. So you, you, you're kind of jealous. You're, you're into Zelda, and uh, you're jealous of us. Mm. I, uh, something tells me that's about to change. He's gonna have to uh, pull his shit together and do something. You wake up straight. You wake up, straighten up, and grow a backbone already. Ah, here comes Zelda to the rescue. Oh shit. Your face is not creepy at all right now. She's gonna like do do that thing girls now do, like the Z with the with the snapping of the fingers. Oh no she didn't. No. Because he's jealous. That's what he is. Yeah, I suppose. All right. <laughs> well, I'm sorry to say, bud, but Zelda's into us. We're out of here, boys. Little Link, hope you find your bird, or else you're gonna have to sit out today's race. Wouldn't you like that? That could be a major setback towards knighthood, so find that bird or get real used to the taste of failure. It's your special favor. flavor. You're an asshole! Yeah. <laughs> Fucking dick. I'm gonna get you back for that. I hate to say it, but I'm beginning to suspect that those blockheads had something to do with your loft wing's disappearance. Link, those guys aren't going to help us find your bird, so we'd better start searching. Yes, let's start searching. Thank you, that's, that, that's, that's actually a good idea. I don't think it's going to turn out in, into anything, but that's a good idea. Father said, uh, so don't worry, I'll find your bird in time. We will. Let me know if uh, me reading these the dialogues is annoying. I, I, I try not to read too much, so it doesn't become too annoying. But if it, if it still is, just let me know in the comments and I'll, I'll stop it. Ooh, okay, so what now? What do I do now? I mean, they didn't really give me any clue. Um, let's try climbing here. They were around here, I don't suppose. Maybe my bird could be around here somewhere? Come on, man. Just <laughs> God damn it, man. Get on the fucking stairs. Can you leap upwards? You can. You look like a retard doing it, but you can. I suppose the stamina garage will be pretty important from here on out. Alright, so this is where we kill ourselves. Let's not kill ourselves. Cause... Oh, fantastic. We can do that. I, I was I was hoping I would roll <laughs> when I, I got back down, but I suppose I can. Wait, what is this right here? What does this say? Night Academy Residential Quarter. Uh, Alright, uh, let's go to Residential Quarter. Let's save the game, by the way. Since, since uh, we're already here, might as well. Might as well. I'm liking my experience so far. I really have no idea where to go, but I'm liking my experience. So there's a, an old lady right there who's blocking the road, talking to her friends. Oh, yeah. Ooh, you're, uh, yeah, you guys are uh, blocking the road here. I like to pass. Is the truth? The only thing my log nut of a son is, is good for is getting grease on his shirt. All I do is laundry, 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 and it never ends. Should I get something to do it for me? Uh, okay, man, whatever. Is anyone really gonna help me here, or what? Am I gonna have to bust a cap? How about this house right here? Because I really don't know what to do. Oh wait, they told me to go talk to Instructor Orwell? Where exactly would that be? Where could I talk to Instructor Orwell? Have I been in here? I don't think so. Shh, let's, let's, let's explore what's in, inside this cupboard. I guess nothing, nothing at all. Anything else? Anyone at all here? Oh, there's a woman right here. 
Kind of uh, banging your knuckles against the door. It's called... <laughs> you're funny. <laughs> I see what you did there. Anyway, you're, uh, you're lucky I'm home and usually ever at the bazaar. That's pretty sad. I mean, it is. Let's, uh, let's open this cupboard. Any panties here? No? I am uh, Link, the panty thief. Hmm, so nothing here. So where should I go? Hmm. Well, what haven't I explored yet? What options do I have? You? I have talked to you. Hey Link, this house belongs to yes, that's you, blah blah blah. Okay, fantastic. Let's get that food right there. Anything happening over here? What's this over here? Oh my god, no 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 no. Um, how can I get out of the water? I really wanna swim out of this. How do I swim by the way? Help. Help! Swimming. Push in the direction you want to swim. Lock on and return to land. Push towards the water's edge. Alright, so... Typical Zelda stuff. Okay, fantastic. Okay, now, don't fail me, Link. Do not fail me, man. Alright, how about you? You look important. What is this? Look at this thing. Who knows how long this statue has been here. Wait, wait, I can move while in first person view? Okay, that's that's new. Didn't used to be able to do this. Uh, Alright, so there's a uh, center. Huh, alright. So we can recalibrate the, the remote by pressing down. That's that's cool, that's useful. I assume we can only come here once we have the sword. That's what experience tells me. But it seems like there's a small cut. Oh, there's my bird. I found my bird. What does this say here? Waterfall cave. Beware of blood-sucking monsters. No kids allowed. All right. And be wearing. But no, uh, how do I get in? Can I? No, I cannot. Okay. I was assuming I couldn't. I was just trying it out, just for the shits and giggles. Okay. So now, where can I get a sword to break those things down? We now have a reason to get a sword now, so... How do you, uh, dive? Hmm, I don't know. Alright. Uh, so how about we go back to the Academy, or back to... Zelda? But Zelda's... Uh, Zelda said she was gonna fly over the area and try to find something, so... I really don't know where she is. So let's just go back to the Academy. Maybe someone will uh, tell me how to get my sword. Someone help me out here. I'm uh, a little bit lost. Let's, let's try this, par this powering area. Maybe this is where I get my sword. Aha! There's a couple of people here. And they weren't here before, so... Yeah, there we go. Come on, talk to them. Aha! There we go. Link! Perfect timing! Yes, he has. Yeah. Why is it? He's gonna butt rape me, so I couldn't tell you, Link. It sounds like Bruce forced him to keep quiet about it. That's what happened. Uh. Ah, I see. So you overheard them planning to kidnap my my uh, my bird. Just as I tried to sneak away, Bruce and his gang grabbed me, grabbed my nuts. Said if I told you, they'd make sure I would never be able to ride a bird ever again because I would have no nutsack. Sounds like Bruce and his buddies had a plan to capture a bird and hide him near the waterfall. Yes, I mean, quick, let's take a look at your map. <laughs> quick, let's do it. Well, that's a finely hand-drawn map. That's right. Uh, that's right there. I think it means the waterfall mark there with X. Where's the waterfall again? Um, I assume I do. Alright, so plus is the map. If you get lost, just press plus. Uh, that's fine, man. It's okay. Alright, let's uh, let's look at the map. So where is... Okay, so the waterfall is right here. Alright, let's let's try the waterfall then. So, uh, what? One more thing, Link. 
There are some dangerous things there. Creepy crawly things. You'll need to carry a sword. I think I saw the Knight Commander go into the sparring hall a while ago. You should go and ask him if you can borrow. Oh, okay. All right, fantastic. We're getting our sword. I'm excited. I'm excited because of the sword mechanics in this game. Um, this is actually the first game that I'm... Well, it's the second game that I'm using the Wii Motion Plus for. I, when I bought it two years ago, I thought there would be more games released that would be using the Wii Motion Plus, but there weren't. There were only a couple. So you still want to get in some sword practice. So this is probably going to be my official, my first official game that I'm using the Wii Motion Plus for. I mean, I played the uh, Wii Sports Resort or something, but that was it. The sword in the back room, go back there and get it. I'll be here waiting for you for a while, so there's anything you don't understand about ho uh, handling a sword? Yes, I will ask you. Alright, so the back room. Let's get the sword from the back room. Why not? Why not? It's probably necessary to advancing the story anyway, so... Oh, let's see how he opens the chest now. Ah, cool. Typical animation, and he looks cool like that. You gotta practice swords. Students at the Knights Academy practice with these. It looks like it has a fairly sharp blade. That's, that's pretty cool. Press 1 at any time to look at the items you're carrying. Okay. 1. That's 2. 1. Aha! So I have my sword now. Fantastic. A sword used by knights in training. The blade still has a sharp edge. Okay. So am I going to have a, some practice lessons here? I, I'm sure we are. We did in every other game, so... Oh yeah, you want to learn about how to use... Yes, I want to learn how to use a sword. Okay, just wave the Wii Remote to swing your sword. Like this? Like this? Wave the Wii Remote like, like in in, the, in the Twilight Princess? Where you just, you know, you, you wiggle the thing around? Wave the Wii Remote vertically to do a vertical slash, and wave it sideways to do a side slash. Thrust the Wii Remote forward to do a thrust. Okay, let's try it out. And then there's the spin attack, a more advanced technique. To do that, we use the Wii Remote and Nunchuck together in a sideways motion. Okay, so both like this. Remember, these moves and uh, you can handle yourself in any fight. Just remember the fundamentals. Always press Z to target an enemy as soon as you see it. Okay, I will. Try getting in some good practice on these logs. If the sword doesn't respond quite the way you want it to, try some big vertical overhead practice swings in front of you. Uh, then you get back to the action. Okay, then you get back to the... okay. Once you've sliced up those logs, I'll set it up so you can try out your big move. Okay, alright. Fantastic. So this game has been out on the internet for a while, and some people have... Okay, let's examine. Can it have a vertical slash? Oh, that's pretty cool. Wait, he, he's mimicking me, so I'm pointing left now, upwards now, downwards, and right. Wow, this is pretty, this is, this is pretty sweet. Fantastic. So yeah, the game has been out for, for a little while on the internet, and some people have made some mods where you don't need to play with, um, with the Wii Remote, so... Okay, this is, so this is a thrust. Ah, okay. That's pretty awesome slashing right here. This seems pretty fun. This seems very fun. This should have been in, in uh, the Twilight Princess all along. You you really are a strong swordsman. Easy to teach you. You make this instructor proud. Are you ready to try a spin attack? Oh yes, I am. Let, let's try the spin attack. Right now, I'm going to surround you with logs. You need to cut them all without moving from that spot. All you have to do is wave the Wii Remote and the Nunchuck horizontally at the same time. Give it a shot. We'll do. Let's try it out, man. Let's try. Okay, so we target, we, uh, how about we just do this without the Z-targeting? Ah, it still works! Good one. This is easy! As Zelda should be. That sure looked like it felt good. It did. So why don't you try a Fatal Blow to close out your session? Sure. What's a Fatal Blow? Is that the, the blow where he jumps in the air and just stabs the guy? When your enemy is down, target it with Z and wave the Wii Remote Nunchuck at the same time to land the Fatal Blow. Wave, wave them in what direction? Do a slide, do a side slash on the log. When it's down, try finishing it off with this technique. Okay. Side slash. And then... Oh, I see. So basically you point the, the nunchuck and the Wii Remote down while pressing Z and he does that. Fantastic. 
Fiddle Blow is also an effective move to use right after you've used your shield or well-placed spin attack, or well-placed spin attack to knock an enemy on its back and then deal critical damage. <sighs> That's a PS3 launch joke. I don't know if a lot of you got it. Oh, but monsters don't stay down for long, so you'll have to wave the Wii Remote and nunchuck quickly before they get back on their feet.